I'm at Barnes & Noble right now. I literally was like, all right, I'm gonna go to Barnes & Noble then go to the gym. Dude. All for 85. It's not really supposed to be on the shelf. I'm gonna see if I can buy it and I'll listen to it. And I'll listen to it for the first time on vinyl. Nope. They're like, uh, it's not showing up in our system. See, the same thing happened at Best Buy, which is right over there. They put out Last of Us Part 1 like a week in advance. And I'm like, bro, f it. let me just buy it. And I couldn't buy it. So let's go to the gym. Actually, when I'm driving to the gym, I think I'll tell the story of me and Logic. In 2016, I was a massive FaZe fanboy. And then I started listening to Logic because of that. Actually, there's another story to that, but I'll tell that in a different video maybe sometime listen to the incredible true story first the song that hooked me was city of stars and i literally went home and i bought the clean version on apple music like itunes i bought it on itunes and i remember the day it was june 30th 2016 literally the next day i woke up and bobby tarantino one came out as a surprise project i was like a massive logic fanboy back in 2016 and 2017 everybody came out may 5th dude i literally posted that shit on my snapchat here look this is a picture of me trying to get people to listen to it that's so random i was hella giving him free ads <coughs> before everybody came out bro i i never forgot this shit. kids would make fun of me for being a fan of logic i know all these brothers i swear to god listening to the new kanye and new ty dollar sign get the f out of here bro you think that's hard you making fun of me for listening to prime logic and then in like 2018 team when Bobby Tarantino 2 came out and like Young Sinatra 4 came out I, I kind of like stopped listening I didn't stop listening to Logic I kind of like slowed down my Logic listening there's like pictures of me back in like 8th grade decked out in Logic merch and oh, I literally bought the bomber jacket because of him and I still actually wear it Ultra 85 very important album to me as I remember the day everybody came out I was hella sad that Logic's next album would be his last album. You know, I was I was part of that shit. Oh my God, Logic's retiring. All the theories with it, the fucking website where you can zoom into the Everybody cover and then in Thalia we trust and shit like that and all the lore that goes along with it. I still have it memorized. I can say it all, but I'm not gonna say it all because that's hella fucking crinia. It is my history. It is who I was. Massive Logic fanboy. Logic is the sole reason I make music. By the way, I have a new song out right now. Go listen to it. If it wasn't for the incredible true story i would have never made music i literally quote that album as the reason i make music and obviously at some point in my life i want to fucking shake the guy's hand you don't even know how much this brother means to me. bro logic is the reason i'm into music i view it like this logic is the reason that i'm into music and i try to discover new artists and try to listen to new music i listen to logic then i found tribe and i found mf doom and i found like all these other people my love for music really originated and then i started i started to get into more sub genres of music because of logic and i started to understand that there's different types of hip-hop and well obviously i knew that shit, but yeah so literally i quote this man and that album as being the reason that i love music so much so shout out to bob one minute remains ultra 85 comes out i gotta load it up here this is gonna be fucking weird dude i've been waiting since i was 14 for this album and i am a 21 year old man in my parents basement i don't stay up late like that if i stay up for an album that means it means something to me uh, before i listen to this just to let you know i have listened to the single most of them are all right and fear is the best one boom reload dude bobby come on all right guys i guess this video is not happening actually let me save my song first all right yo guys let's listen to my song instead since logic's album is not working <laughs> dude what the sand wow. okay here we go nine minutes, the minutes what the f bob so i came over we we're supposed to watch 500 days of summer um, good movie. what's up what's happening bitch we live probably thought you never see the day of ultra 85 it's been a minute but maybe yeah now we in it what's that the past the present the future and yes the beyond i know them but you can't make them dude, drink whoa. bitch i'm being me the fuck you think this dude, is i am i just I mean, bro, I'm in. just dawned on me what i'm listening to again like Thanos, hairline like fontano's rocking a yellow flannel y'all can't <laughs> seem prodigy i leave them shook ones that know me know how much it took back rank check no shit i remember Telling fuck flex, people call me a try hard. He said, You know why, God? Because they tried and couldn't do it. So that's what is it? Yeah, and every time they see you winning, they have to relive it. Oh, yeah, now come now, boy, forget it. We with it. I'm going crazy, committed. This shit they talking omitted. Dude, this sounds like prime logic. Like, this sounds like that 2017, 2016, 2015, 2015. I used to think it was the streams, used to think it was the plaques, used to think it was the wars. He's just going in, bro. This is what I like. Not that I'm the love, the music, the people, the drums, the happy. The sad, the highs and the lows Let me repeat this so all of y'all out there listen to know The flow, the love
love, the music, the people, the... Mm. Ah, Thomas and Kylor. Oh, this is the end of everybody. So, you're my new partner, huh? Yes, sir. The name's William Kai. First Wait. officer and man of infantry, and I take it you're this vessel's new captain. Is this a prequel? Feels like it's quantum cannons engaged. Mission 1019, go for departure. Stardate 2110. Mission control has given access granted. Emergency systems green and fuel is 100%. Oh, shit. Well, don't worry. I brought music. Oh, I like that. Dude, that's when Thomas and Kai met each other? So that's gotta be... It can't be incredible true story. Okay, so Logic explained that if you listen to Under Pressure, because Under Pressure is you as Thomas... No, wait. That's, they met. That's when they just met. They knew each other in Incredible True Story. So let's... Thomas driving... Okay, I'm being a nerd. I'm getting too deep into this. Let's just continue. I've heard the song before. I don't think it's outstanding. Open up the rhyme book and read the composition. I can truly give a fuck about the competition. Why are they listening to Ultra 85 first, technically? Unless this is a separate album. The album Ultra 85 starts at a specific point, maybe? I don't know. Dude, it just sounds like a cut off like vinyl days. Not gonna lie, bro. I mean, it's alright. It's not like anything super outstanding. It genuinely feels like a vinyl days cut. Gangsta Grizzly, Grizzly, Grizzly. Very nice, dude. Damn, man. That was a vibe. You really know your shit. Seeing as we live in a giant space station hovering over our destroyed home planet of Earth, I gotta say, I've seen just about all the space I want to see. I'm sorry, bro. The mixing on this is so ass. Like, bro, you can literally hear when it cuts. Man, I knew your ass looked too young to be a captain. Bro, I'm 47. I'm 38. Let's take your mind off it. Who's your favorite director of all time? Okay, let's... We're gonna pause before Fear. Fear is such a f***ing good song. I wish Logic would go in a similar direction for our future project. I know Steve Bloom is an incredible voice actor because I've watched Cowboy Bebop, a uh, dubbed version. But Jesus Christ, bro. This sounds so unnatural. I'm sorry. Bro, it's just two people talking and they don't like... It's like they're not cutting each other off when they're supposed to cut each other off. So they, like, finish the statement and then he, like, cuts them off. It's like... I don't know. I'm getting nitpicky. I can't let you hold me back. Oh, no. Dude, I love this song. This song is crazy. Okay, let's see if I let's see if I remember the verse. Let's see, I remember. Let's see, I remember. Take a minute and think about what you're doing and why you're doing and why you're pursuing it. Is you really happy? I've been out going around and back again. I'm back with it. Bro. Okay, it's all good. I'm surprised at myself. Like it. Actually, I can't even hear myself over this song. I do whatever the fuck I want to do, and I want to do what I come to the world and create. I don't rap anymore, bro. I'm, I'm bringing my shit back. I would probably ask you. Dude, this is some. Ooh, I'm off. But his wife to this song. I'm just trying to do my best. That was a little too intimate. I don't know why I always lie to myself. It's a gorgeous composition right now. Hell no. Are you telling me you actually put Nolan over Tarantino? Yes. You are absolutely full of shit if you believe that. <laughs> Look, I'm not saying I think he's better, right? Two words Pulp Fiction. Of course, it's a classic. I'm just saying. Is that Logic's favorite Tarantino we, movie? Are we gonna find out Logic's favorite Tarantino movie? Dude, I remember that was a big mystery. <laughs> bro, it's like Loki. Like, I'm not trying to be a dick, Bob. But, bro, Loki, what? Like, you literally made this mystery? It's like the dumbest fing mystery ever. It's like, oh, out of these nine movies, or no, at the time, it was like, at these seven movies, which is his favorite. When I was like 13, I was like, guys, I have some theories. I didn't mention this last night, but I literally just thought about it. I used to run a Logic fan page. <laughs> Bro, I do not remember the login for it. Private account. This is the account. It's called Rubik's Logic. Love!
All right, we're getting into some new music now, which I'm pretty excited about. So literally everything we listen to, except for the skit and the skit in fear. So this is a new song. I'm very excited. Heavy is the neck that wears the chain, gripping the grain, trying to maintain, filling this weed through the blood to my brain, writing these lyrics in the back of the train, trying to sustain through the pain. Been smoking and drinking a little more than I acceptable. It's not acceptable. The bitch in me is undetectable. I'm too respectable. Conceptual will my albums be in a studio till round about three. Never paid a fee. You fucking with me? Get it for free. Now let it breathe. Murdering it with ease. Peep the prestige. I spend degrees. This shit Dude, free. See, this is good logic. Head, he knows cuss. how to do Even it. Y'all weak like five plus two. Bust the door and rush through. Getting his bread. Cause the people fuck with it. Your whole shit stale. Wouldn't feed nuts oh. with it. They dope like a chimney. I've been me. Bro, he knows how to do it. It's like old logic and new logic mixed together. Very clever bars there. It's just like a nice song. Like it's like a nice boom bap song. Jump on the Aquarius three. It's just Quentin Will and me. We all head to the paradise where I'm finna set you free. Forget it like that. Once I write that, I recite that. I be like that. I'ma need that back. Don't need no stack. Yeah, that's a fact. All eight of the TPACK. Yeah, that's the pack. We bringing it back like Nazareth. They mad at this. The catalyst. Give a fuck. Don't do it to me. Don't you dare. That should be it. You calibrating the new ATM series? Yeah, man, these new robots could take out a whole army. Why don't we turn them on? Captain, the robot shouldn't be Taken out of the wrapper, yeah, I know. But I'd like to make sure I'm acquainted with the entire crew. My name is Adam, Artificial Tech Machina, Cybernetic Relations. Nice. Adam, I'm Captain, Captain Quentin Thomas, 47 years old, top of his class, graduation, proficient in terminal execution via spacecraft and what the fuck? IQ 179, 98.4 aim consistency. Wow. Damn the brother smart. Adam. Okay, Adam, what do you know about anime? Well, huh. Captain. This beat, man. Like I got people that love me and some people that can't stand me. But no matter what they say, I know I am me. I'm a champ like Nori and Ethan way down in Miami. No, the game can never ban me. I'm a renegade like M and J. Hey. Kid in a dorm room with a dream of his own. These haters are trying to man playing Call of Duty online, rocking with face plan. I'm a millionaire with a dad by and a couple. Dude, I want to sound like a bitch, bro. I'm getting emotional. Because, bro, hearing that note in the beginning of the song. You know in the... Oh, my God. You know in the beginning of this video where I showed pictures of myself from, like, that? Everyone to listen to everybody. I heard that note and it just, like, sent me back. Oh, for this. Oh, it is. This is educated black playing with me, get you smacked for a while. Been on these cubic sipping a soul, but my energy still miles with the yak. I'm sharp as Shannon, you skip because you skip in facts for sure. I don't know who that is. I don't know if that's, I think it's ADE. Very good verse. Oh my god, dude. Dude, Vas, like. Brother Vas, that instrumental where bob were in the maroon bomber jacket in his old house studio two hundred thousand dollar home studio i know about this shit. that's the clip that everyone's like yo it's gonna be on the next album it wasn't on young know, sinatra 4 it wasn't on bobby tarantino dude that beat is like 2017 to me that's what it sounded like hey, come on lucy rose just what do I gotta say? I've been on tour so long, feel like ain't nothing left. It's in these moments that I find freedom. In the midst of a bad day, good thoughts, I greet them. When I'm riddled with anxiety, it's hard to find sobriety. Comparison is destroying your passion. Used to be full of dreams, now you barely have a ration. Yo, listen. Damn, that shit hit, bro. And your heart still beats as you listen. So take it day by day and make the right decision. Add something to this world or multiply division. Dude, it makes me so happy to listen to a Logic album. It like heals my inner child that I've lost over the years, like he's mentioned in the song. In that 13 year old me putting it back into me. Damn, bro. Literally when the only thing in my life that mattered, making videos about CS, listening to Logic, that's it. This is bringing me back, man. Oh, dude. 
nut transition. Here we are now. Definition of a schmerical rapper has been a decade, it's a miracle. I'm still a rapper. Okay, this is very modern logic sound. Yeah, I am the blackest white boy that you ever seen, nigga. Please, it's apparent. My skin is transparent. <laughs> Only color I ever <laughs> Dude, the ends of these songs are like soundtrack really. Thank God for synthetic gravity and ribeye that never came from a cow. But wasn't it also because of AI that every country in the entire world deployed nukes as an auto defense against Russia's initial attack on the new Americans? Mm. I mean, but the steak though. Ah, so good. Now I could speak. Um Interstellar, very sexy song. Incredible song. In retrospect, is like my least favorite one so far. And it's just like, I don't know, like felt like I, I saw the vision for it. I just didn't enjoy it like that. It was my least favorite one so far. This one's like a, a very confessions era logic. Young Sinatra for to confessions yeah. era logic. Hey, day one, day one, day one. It's for my day one. Fuck about a fake one. Smoking that wonder one till it's all done and post give me that good shit. And Elena wish a motherfucker would shit. 44, 44, 44, 44. I'm coming. The killers, I'm bringing the illness. Why you think they feel us? I know. Give a fuck about your feelings. I know. Bad, I'm around till I can't even speak. Get the joke because the beat cut out and then I can't even speak. Ha ah, Or oh, funny. This is literally Confessions era sounding, which is like my least favorite logic era and most people's least favorite logic era. Again, it's just like, all right. Give me a moment to think. Give me a moment to blink. Give me a moment to get it all together. Living in a brand new world with a brand new way to the people think. And I can't get it done. No, I can't get none. Feel like Rudy on the run from the Destra hand. Don't test me, man. I'm blessed to have a fan, but still a man with problems and I can't solve them. Give me, give me, give me the light. Alright, it's gonna transition, I think. I believe. Or not. That. See, that's like the fast logic rapping that I talk about where it's like kind of annoying at some point. I feel like with that instrumental, it worked very well. Very chill, very nice to hear. Are you not entertained? How the hell are we supposed to kill these things? They look like giant scaly lions. Oh shit, here, take this in between. Aim with their hearts. Oh. Oh, Kai's been shot! He's down! Oh no, Kai's dead! Reapproaching to your right, Captain. No! It can't be! Thomas, no! Thomas, get up! Thomas, get up! Game over. You're dead. Game over. God You're dead. damn! Why are you freezing like that? Fuck you, chess is amazing. Why even play shit like this? Honestly? Yeah. As an escape. I may not get that game, but I get that. Sand what? Dude, I remember seeing like, oh my god, Kai's been shot. And I'm like, oh, then this is like the story. Like how the story is gonna end. And it's like, that was Thalia? Dude, I'm so confused on the timeline now. Okay, so if the end of... So this is the meeting. Then why was Thomas picking up... Bitch, I'm so confused. Me like this is You bugging me like zzzz. Zi, zi, zi. Make some friends and I make some M's and I got that bands. Got a song with Boo, got a song with M. Feel like this high won't ever end, but it's all pretend. On top of the world and got a divorce in front of the world and get a new girl. And what do Whoa. I see? My fuck rap. This the day that nobody could take from me. The day my son was born, I saw the whole world differently. I'm not defined by my past. This a different me, and you can teleport the fuck up out my face if you feel differently. Again, I just think that song is just all right. It's nothing super incredible. You're bugging out like zzz is a pretty funny bar though. They bugging out like zzz 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 E4. <laughs> E5. Bishop C4. Knight C6. They're C6. Right that great grandfather Clark robbed this train car full of gold with his gang. And during the robbery, there was a chess tournament being held in first class. It was such a cool story, I decided to learn how to play. Brother Vos? Shut up, Kai. Brother Vos? You got that wax shit in your playlist, this the antidote. My bitch is bad as fuck, got two kids sipping, yeah, she smoked. A lean and a bitch, rock the 
so he wants to be Lil Durk and Baby Keem at the same time and Yeet at the same time. Only fucking with the cloud, cause your money running out. I see the drought, the fuck you talking about? Everyone know you were, ain't no talking that bad as fuck. I took his sip and yeah, she smoked. Uh, little fun song. Very, like, modern 2020s rap sounding. Alright. Logic's favorite Quentin Tarantino movie is Quentin It's once upon a time in Hollywood. Nine years since I did the incredible true story. Now let me break down my career through the films in this category. In the back lot, surrounded by guns, killers, and crack rock. Which God could have re-edited that shot? I guess not. My lungs like Mr. White. I'm far from Mr. Right. My childhood home, really honestly, I don't miss the sight. Nothing but fight or flight. We never freeze. Increase the light about degrees and ending like the trees. Hello, yes, reference for So my favorite Tarantino movie used to be Kill Bill. I felt like Beatrix well on my way to the top. Good ass writing. But what's his favorite Tarantino movie? Is it Once Upon a Time in Hollywood? But that's not what he was talking about on Metropolis with the woman on the train. That bar went over my head. His favorite Tarantino movie when he was talking to the woman on the train, and the mystery was answered last night, and it is Kill Bill. Volume one. Very good, very good writing on that. That's the logic I remember. Yeah, doing 70 on this highway. In the back of this bus, I'm busting my mind open, open. These lyrics connect like Tetris effect. Okay, I guess it's not. Give me coping, like right, like coping. My jizz and mugs, my mama wildin' while I'm trying to find my style in the game. While the legends was killing it, I was crawling in the game. It feel like Rooster Jenkins while the rest revolve around a dollar word. That's like an album. I was afraid to say nigga for years. Not in my life, but on the record, cause these niggas here. Don't like the fact that I'm a half breed and they make it clear. Never stop, no, never give up your dream. And no matter the adversity, you'll always reign supreme. What? It's kind of crazy that he's been saying peace, love, and positivity his whole career, and now he made a song called Peace, Love, and Positivity. Well, kid, looks like we head back to Babel in the morning. I know, man. Six weeks already? Hey, now, play nice. At least Adam has a body. What are you going to do with your time off when you get back, man? Mm, same thing as always. Train and prepare for the next one. I can't. I know I'm laying the foundation for a generation that will. Okay, let's go uh, around. Uh. You gon' be a star, show them from afar. You gon' be ignited when they don't like who you are. I'm a steady clock and in the jobs, only option is to rob. I let them rob me of my dream that I believe could be achieved if you just give me a break. To breathe, or is it too late? The love of being a human being, I'm being trying to be the opposite of what I see on my screen. False profit, profit to top of rockets, not trying to stop it, just trying to get the kids another option before they cut. Rhyme and everything that I find. Every other day I think about a life away from that, away from rap. I went to hell and made it back, I made it to heaven. And my reality full of vitality had to be me. Why they mad at me? Said it emphatically. The Order of the Ultra 85. How long is it gonna take to deliver it? <laughs> We're the boss. We're on the last track of Ultra 85. This is crazy. This is some shit. This is the end. And this story for the Sonic. I just remember that the book is coming out. So like tell a deeper part of the story. Final track. Everything I need in this life Everything I need Mission Control, this is Captain Quentin Thomas of the Aquarius 3 requesting permission to dock. Yeah, Mission Control here. Initiation complete. Anything you can be interested in, you'll find others who are. Facts. All the film and movies and clowning on you guys? Hey man, it's not my fault. But if they find out you've been out of your- First officer, I think the robot can keep a secret. Mum's the word. I won't say shit. Well boys, it looks like we finally come to the end of this chapter. See you on the next one, cowboy. Okay, so it has to be a prequel. So it goes Ultra 85, then there's like a time in between, and then 
when they get information that Planet Paradise exists, then Thomas goes and picks up Kai while listening to Under Pressure, and they go to Paradise, and then they walk around Paradise. They play Young Sinatra for. I'm trying to compute this in my head because it like makes sense, but it like also doesn't make sense. But that was much better than I assumed because I listened to the singles obviously, and then I said what I thought about the singles. I just thought they were not as interesting as I wish like the worst songs on the album which is like a lovely thing to happen so I'm, I'm very excited that it was it was pretty good my rating is not an 85 it is an 80 sorry i added up on my scores very good job bobby this is much better than college park i'm sorry i know there's fans of college park college park voice acting is not that good the voice acting in this i'm sorry and to be truthful is not very good stuff on incredible true story is so much better than that i'm excited to read the book to know the full story I feel like a part of my childhood just ended, but it feels pretty good. Now I can like listen to Ultra 85 and then that, and I like you get the whole story and under pressure in between. It's 1.30 in the morning. I'm gonna go to bed, literally get up in like four or five hours and edit this video for you guys. So God bless. I'm out. Drilling.